Hey guys, Trevor Boone from Emerald City Guitars, and today my pick of the day is this 1959 Fender Stratocaster in Fiesta Red. A total custom color, 100% original, ridiculous, ridiculous instrument. So as many of you know, custom colors, original custom colors are hen's teeth. They're hard to come by and, you know, another Joe Bonamassa quote, all are guilty until proven innocent, which I love because a lot of them went through really nice refins, old refins that look pretty good. And we get crazy about, you know, when these come in, black lighting them and everything we can do to ensure that it's real. But when something like this comes in, it makes the job a little bit easier. This has the full paper trail of the lifespan of this guitar. This is an old Baltimore band called The Centuries, where this gentleman, the original owner, you can see all these crazy pictures of him with his brand new guitar when he picked it up in 59. And it's one of the coolest things to see. We've got the record that he recorded, Brenda and the Centuries, so it looks like the Centuries kind of backed up a couple different artists. There's tons of pictures of this guitar being played back in the day with uh, all their crew cuts and matching suits and stuff. It's, it's just ridiculous. There's also a picture of Eric Johnson playing this guitar at one point. They were able to show him this instrument and have him play it and sit down, with, which is just a cool bonus, you know. It's fun to see that it started there, ended up in Eric Johnson's hands and now we have it. And a couple of things about this guitar that blow, blow me away is just how vibrant this Fiesta Red is. It changes, it varies over the years, different undercoats, how they age, all sorts of things. The environment that it, that it was in, this guitar is so, so vibrant and just, I mean, the finish is in amazing condition. You know, you've got some, some wear here and there, but if you, you know, a little bit of buckle rash, but it just looks perfect. It's one of the coolest Fiestas I've ever seen. The slab board on this, it's like the darkest Brazilian I've ever seen. It's crazy, it almost looks ebony. Uh, the mint guard, tuners are awesome, all functional. This guitar is, is perfect, it's crazy. It's a 59, so it's got a really cool, playable, kind of a cool shreddy neck almost, nice and thin up here. Gets a little wider as you go up, just perfect contour. An eight screw pit guard, which is so cool. Very, very early, transitional, that's a huge part. A lot of guys who saw this guitar immediately pointed out. It's a rare bird and it's so it's so cool to see as a 59 because we've had you know we've had a good amount of 62s, 63s that have been fiesta and they're awesome. They're fantastic guitars too, but to see something that's the full slab board and in the 50s, a custom color with the paper trail, it is it's amazing. This is what it's all about and we totally just geek out and and freak out when something like this comes in. You can't ask for more. Again, the Tweed case, the record it was recorded back on back in the day on B Records, Brendan, the Centuries, probably five or six pictures similar to this one of the original owner with it. Eric Johnson played it, which is just a cool bonus, like I said, but overall, super, super light guitar with the slab board, this era, just nice and dried out. It definitely gets all those cool, you know, the Steve Ray Vaughan Lenny tones, it gets the cool Mayer stuff. There's something about those little slab boards that just kind of slightly compress the high end that Strats inherently have. So they just get this cool kind of mushy tone to them. It's unbelievable. So if you're looking for a no issue, cool provenance, 100% original, custom color from the 50s, here you are. Here is what we have to offer. And we don't have anything else like it in the shop right now. So this thing is in the glass case with the pictures and all that. But I've been taking it out the last couple of days just to play it because it's so damn fun. But Anyways, we had to do a pick of the day on it. We're excited about having it. It's only been here for a couple days with the holidays. We've been uh, behind on getting all the stuff listed up. So we decided to do a video today. And I have my buddy, Brian Barrows, who has been here a couple times. He's doing this Fiesta Red through this 64 Vibroverb today. Should sound awesome. I can't stress enough how wacky it is to see this color, 50s, slab board, eight, eight screw pit guard. It's insane. It should be. <laughs> It should be wrong, but it's right. And they have everything to prove it. We've done obviously all our research just to confirm that on top of everything. And it's, it is 100% the truth. So here you have it, a Fiesta Red Strat from 1959, dead stock, lightweight, <laughs> dream guitar. All right, let's see how it sounds.
That was a Holy Grail 1959 Fender Stratocaster in its original custom color Fiesta Red through this 64 Vibroverb. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time.